Spring is the time of the year that leaves grow on the trees. The temperature rises and we can enjoy the outdoor again. This period also comes with an increased activity of aggressive horseflies. In their quest for food and reproduction, they will start looking for blood. Blood from livestock, horses, but also human blood. It is all the same for the horsefly. If you have ever been bitten by a horsefly, then you know how painful this is. To take sufficient blood from the wound, a horsefly inserts a chemical substance into the wound that ensures that this wound remains open for a longer period of time. As a result, these wounds do not heal fast. And there is a realistic chance of an infection, especially for horses and cows, as they are not in a position to protect themselves from these aggressive predators. The H-trap attracts and collects these horseflies and keeps them away from horses and humans. Horseflies are not able to see the normal light spectrum as we know it. Instead, they see infrared. Objects that emit heat show such an infrared emission. Centrally placed in the H-trap is a large black ball. Placed outside, the sun starts warming up the H-trap, and this heat from the sun is absorbed by the black ball. Horseflies see this infrared energy from the ball from a large distance and interpret this as a warm body. Assuming that this body will give them the much desired and needed blood, it will start traveling to the ball of the H-trap. Soon after they have landed on the ball, they will find that they are not able to draw blood and will try and leave the H-trap. As horseflies can only fly off in an upward vertical flight direction, escaping from the H-trap is not an option. It is now a matter of time before the horseflies will find themselves in a collect bin, which is placed in the upper part of the H-trap system. H-trap offers a non-chemical, effective control of horseflies.